Hey guys, so what is going on? Lego Man 123 and welcome back to another video. Where today I'll be ranking the Lego Ninjago 2022 Ninja Suits. So without further ado, let's get into it. Starting off at number 6 is Nia, and the reason she's so high on the list is because compared to the other ninja, I just think her torso printing is way too plain and simple with like the swirl detailing in the blue compared to the rest of the ninja which I think has some really awesome printing and quite a lot of detail but don't get me wrong I definitely think the dark grey colouring and the blue looks really awesome for Nia but I think the torso print of like those swirls make such a really cool pattern and I definitely think it works best for Nia However, I just wish they gave us some more printing on the torso because compared to the rest of the ninja, she really doesn't stand out as well as she should. Then at number 5 is Lloyd, and very similar to Nia, I just think compared to the rest of the ninja, his torso printing is quite plain and simple, but I definitely think his is a little more better than Nia's because I really like the lime green coloring for like the pattern he does have like those sort of triangles and I definitely think it stands out just a little more compared to like the sort of spyro design which is on Nia. But compared to Nia I think Lloyd's leg printing is just a little more better. I really like the detailing and the printing on it and that is why he placed a little higher than Nia. Then at number four is Cole, and what I like about Cole is that the pattern in that orange color, it starts at the torso and then also continues down to the legs, and I definitely think that is really cool, and I think it stands out compared to the rest of the ninja, and I think the color scheme in like that sort of black and orange color looks really awesome, and I also really like the detailing for the torso, and I think it works a little more better compared to the other two ninja because with like that sort of orangey pattern I, he sort of symbolizes a rocks in a way and I definitely think that looks really cool. Now moving on to the top three we start with Kai and what I love most about Kai is the detailing or the print of like the flame on his torso and it also does continue onto the legs very similar to Cole, and I definitely think that flame looks really awesome, and I'm really glad they did include that, because I think it's such a key part to who Kai is, and I think the sort of orangey red colour works really nicely. However, with the colour scheme for Kai, I just don't think the orange and the red work, because I think the orange should always go to Cole, because I think black and orange work very nicely together, and it just looks a lot more better because with the orange and the red I just don't think they work because they have two very similar sort of looks as like the same color and I just think they could have gone for like a yellow color maybe or just another version of red because I just think orange and red they look too similar on like the same minifig and I just don't think it works as a pattern. Then at number two is Zane and he was almost my favorite minifig. I really love the detailing on the torso with like those sort of ice shard prints on either side and I definitely think that is a huge standout compared to the rest of the ninja because they primarily only have prints on like the one side but Zayn does have some really awesome printing on both sides. The thing what didn't make him number one is with the rest of the ninja they each have two different colored sleeves. And with that inconsistency, I just think he's like the odd one out because the rest of the ninja have two different colored sleeves with like the, the color scheme they have. And I just wish for Zayn they also did that because they could have had like one sort of a silver gray color and then one white. But I just think it's a missed opportunity because he would have most definitely been my number one ninja. So then that leaves Jay for number one. And the reason he is number one is because I really love the color scheme they've gone for with like that sort of very light yellow and blue. And I think the yellow really suits him well because it does sort of represent lightning. And I really love the printing of like that sort of lightning shape. And I just think that works so well for Jay because obviously he is the lightning ninja. And I'm really glad they found a way to actually include that. But I just wish... They did that for like the rest of the ninja. They did attempt that 
for Zayn with like that sort of eye shards and then also Cole with like that sort of orangey pattern to actually represent like rocks for the elemental power of Earth. But I just think it works quite well for like Jay out of the rest of the ninja. So, hope you guys did enjoy this video because I really did enjoy sharing my thoughts and opinions and also ranking the Lego Ninjago 2022 Ninja suits. And I definitely think these Ninja suits for the upcoming new Lego Ninjago wave is definitely the strongest part about those sets because I definitely think all of them look really awesome in their own way and I'm really excited to actually have them in my collection. So, as always, guys, hope you guys did enjoy this video, and I can see you soon. Goodbye!